day one in Rome was really just an evening as we had taken the train in earlier that morning. We checked into our hotel, rest a little bit, and then headed on our way down to Vatican City. Fortunately, our hotel was only about a 15 minute walk and because we only had Saturday and Sunday in Rome, we really had to do Vatican City this half day because everything would kind of be closed for services on Sunday. And the thing that surprised me most about Vatican City was just how big all of the buildings were. They were absolutely gorgeous and I just could not get over the size of them. Unfortunately, we didn't get to go inside the St. Peter's Basilica because the line was so long. It was already wrapped around basically the entire courtyard and we had a timed ticket for the Vatican Museum, which we actually bought a two to three weeks in advance and there was only like one time slot left. So if you do plan on visiting, I highly recommend buying your ticket way in advance. The museum was really nice. There was a ton of stuff in there. I had no idea the Vatican owned that many pieces of art. We were kind of sort of ushered through different areas and then we got to the Sistine Chapel and we actually finished our evening off with a little happy hour that we also booked in advance. After the museum closed, we walked back through the courtyard area. Just seeing everything lit up at night was really, really beautiful. And at that point, we just headed back to our hotel and called it a night and got ready for day two in Rome. 